as we've kind of gone through this, so in the aftermath of the revolts, you know, you mentioned it, it's still up in the air. It's not necessarily written in stone who's in charge, but it seems from what I've been reading in, in the, you know, Wars of the Jews by Josephus, that even internally within the family of the Maccabeans, that there is kind of um, ambition for who is going to be in charge. It, it just seems that there's cutthroat, <laughs> cutthroat wars for who's going to be king or high priest in, in charge there. Is this accurate? Absolutely. It, it's, it's clearly, even after the Maccabees are in charge, and especially after Jonathan and after the death of Simon, uh, the Maccabee, um, the position continues to be unstable. Right, the 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 Maccabees managed to install a system of kind of Hellenistic kingship. I think we talked about that very briefly earlier, but their authority is still questioned, especially also from within the family. And then there are other groups whom we had not talked about as much, and we talked about the community at Qumran, who clearly at this time period, now one thirties, one forties who decide we're done. We're no longer part of this group. This is not right. We want to be away. It is, it is also this time period when the Maccabees are, are starting to fight uh, wars against its closest neighbors. Uh, Samaria gets overrun and conquered. Idumea, we talked about the city of Moresha, gets overrun and conquered and destroyed in 112. Uh, and these people, we are told, get forcibly conversed into Judaism. It's a very vol continues to be a volatile period. It continues to be highly unstable at the level of the central power. Brothers are murdering brothers. Um, but clearly also underlying many, many of the tensions that we later, uh, those of us who, who want to read the Gospel of Mark, Gospel of Matthew, the stories that we see these different Judean groups in um, in the time of the Jesus movement are still there, right? I mean, that's a hundred years later, uh, but it still tells you that even so, I indicate, and I think it's true that this is a time period in which gets solidified what Judaism in the second century and first century becomes. There's still many, many other alternative options, and and that also has political consequences.